Gosh, it's going to be hard to go back to summer now after this beautiful low humidity we've had the last few days. Looking out on the CAGS weather cam, it is a dry night. Temperatures are mild since the sun has set, starting to drop nicely after our high this afternoon of 91 degrees. But even though we were up to 91, that low humidity really took the edge off the heat. It wasn't anything like our normal 90s in the summertime here in the Brazos Valley. 68 was our morning low. That was in town at Eastwood Airport. Outlying areas like Hearn and, and uh, over in Huntsville and Madisonville, temperatures dropped down close to 60 degrees this morning. Uh, those readings, of course, well below average, and there were some record record lows in the upper 50s and lower 60s out in the hill country. Well, current temperatures are uh, back down into the 70s over parts of the Brazos Valley. 76 in Caldwell, 74 in Hearn, 76 also in Navasota, and 75 in Madisonville. At Easterwood, 80 degrees right now with clear skies, but the dew point is still in the upper 50s. 59 right now gives us a relative humidity of 48%. Winds are light out of the east, but they are going to switch around to the southeast over the weekend, and that will start to bring the Gulf moisture back in higher humidity, a few more clouds, and a slight chance of rain. And along with the higher humidity and the hot temperatures will come a return of the heat index. We're talking heat index values probably over 105 Saturday and Sunday afternoon. So uh, after a few days of a break from that, you're going to have to make sure that you follow those heat safety precautions again. Some shower activity over the desert southwest and the central and southern Rockies right now. This is their rainy time of year in the southwest, believe it or not, when they have scattered showers, what they call the monsoon season out there in the southwest. But also they're underneath a big upper level high pressure ridge and the jet stream, which was diving southward and bringing us this a rare cold front here in late July. Well, the jet stream is back up to the north now. The high pressure is going to really dominate our weather pattern. But with the high pressure, with the jet stream moving back up to the north, that spells a return of the higher humidity. Now, tomorrow, still low humidity and still mostly sunny skies, shower activity offshore in the Gulf. By Saturday, moisture starts to work in, so we look for higher humidity, a few clouds more, and also a slight chance of showers Saturday afternoon and Sunday. Tomorrow, still mostly sunny, 69 in the morning at 8, 87 at noon, and 92, your 5 o'clock temperature, uh, 93 for the high tomorrow. And then as we get up into the mid-90s over the weekend, again, heat index uh, values topping out at around 105 or 6. Also, a 20% chance of showers or thunderstorms in the afternoon. And by the middle of next week, rain chances start to drop off and temperatures get up into the upper 90s. In fact, by late next week, we could see temperatures near 100. Oh yeah, that's coming back.